you go. What's up, y'all? JT here with a 4S run. It's not going to be 6S uh, of my Kronos XTR 2022 version. So you guys know that it does come with an extra body. And I went ahead and painted this extra body and put it on here. And I put a Willy bar and stuff on here, too, and just put some custom decal stickers and stuff on there. So we're going to run this briefly. I'm probably not going to run it that hard because I kind of want to keep this body for a show body. But I did at least want to get it out and get a little dust and dirt on it. But I probably won't run it on the street because I don't want to flip this body but anyway and this truck as you guys know is plenty fast on 4s <laughs> won't be too much need for a 6s light point here we're running like this so And as I'm running this, I will tell you guys so far, this truck has held up. Team Corrali did fix their, some of their durability issues that they had in the past with their cars, especially those steering blocks. I can't stress that enough. And it's been good. You guys know this truck topped out at about 65 miles per hour with the stock tires and stock, you know, diff grease and all that stuff. Um, I didn't change any of that out. And it has a lot more in it, so it can probably do about 70. Maybe a little more if you change that out, but. So, so far, so good. And you get a spare body. <laughs> that I shot, but I didn't include that clip in the unboxing, so I don't know what was going on that night I was doing that, but. So I know you won't see in this particular video a lot of jumping and stuff. I just kind of wanted to get this out. I might do one mile jump like that. <laughs> I think it's cool that they actually include that second body in here. In case you want to have a show body, you want to maybe, or you want to keep, oh, ooh, ooh. you want to keep the uh, original body for a show body and maybe paint this one color and use that for your bashing body. I don't know what you'll do, but you do get an extra body. So that's a good thing, an extra clear body. And you get extra decals in there. And of course, as I said before, this does not come with the Willy bar. I added that on there, but you can order one. You can always get one online. Tiny Adventures RC has some of those in stock. But it's a nice, beautiful day out here in Georgia. It's actually about 70 degrees, so I just kind of wanted to get out and just do some mile running. You know how it is to kind of just enjoy your RC cars. I actually wasn't going to film, but since I had this new body on here, I figured I might as well get this rolling a little bit. So more than likely, I'm going to add the 15 tooth pinion gear. This has still got the 13 in there and run this on 4S and probably leave it at that. Like I said, that's probably about as uh, as much as I'm gonna jump with this body on here. <laughs> Except for down there. Look at this thing going for us, y'all. <laughs> I 
Those are baby jumps. And I owe you guys kind of a jumping video. I did something a while back, but I guess I didn't make it a complete jumping video on jumping your car. Some of you guys may or may not know. Um, start off small. I'm not even gonna lie. Don't start off trying to do something big. Get used to the car, and it is a difference in four-wheel drive and of course two-wheel drive jumping and stuff. You guys see as I'm jumping, I am kind of putting my brake on, and that is lowering my front end. If I stay on the throttle, it's just gonna lift it up and literally either do a backflip or land on this roof. But I did put the brake on there. I saw it kind of level out and then I let off the brake and just let the tires kind of rotate more, so. And see right there, it was flipping, or it was jumping and it was about to flip forward so I actually gave it some throttle to kind of level it out. So I'll probably try to get out and get a ramp or get to a bigger area and show you guys about that and show you guys about doing backflips and talk about throttle control and all that. But you do have to know your vehicle to do that. It's like anything else. So, But we'll have that coming up. And we do have a SWAT meet coming up too, uh, March 26th. Information, you guys saw that flyer. Just hopefully I can remember to put that in here. <laughs> so, and they do have a track there too. Um, so you guys, if you want to run on their track, it is $10. The swap meet is free, but bring your own table. Um, we're trying to get a food truck out there. Uh, I will be there if you guys want to meet me out there too. I'm pretty sure other people from YouTube may be out there as well that live close to that area, but we'll see. All right, y'all, I'm gonna run this and enjoy this while I'm out here. So that is a run of this. I wanted to run this with this body on here. Uh, RC Speed Monsters, we need some mud guards for this. So how about that? Uh, and uh, maybe aluminum wing or something like that. So I'll have to get with Jeff about seeing if he can do some, um, some parts and stuff for this. But anyway, guys, put your comments down below to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos. I'm gonna run this thing some more.